Over 1,000 students from the Detroit Public Schools who signed a drug-free pledge spent the day learning about career opportunities within the construction industry at the 6th Annual Construction Science Expo on May 17th at the Michigan Science Center in Detroit. This event is so important because the construction skills trades have been consolidating over the last decade. And we've got a lot of companies that are struggling to find workers. So this is the great event to provide that pipeline into great paying jobs. I heard a term uh, used a while back called educate and pray. You get educated and then you pray for a job. Within the apprenticeship opportunities, you're actually being educated and working at the same time, being paid to learn your trade as you build your skills. We've got kids that are, they're smart and they're into a lot of different things. It's just a way to try to channel that, get them in the right direction, and we hire them and they build our future. The Expo provides an opportunity for youth to see the industry up close, in a hands-on way, using equipment and machinery that many may never get to experience otherwise. My favorite things about today was jackhammering. I learned how to do that because I never tried to do that. Well, they showed a video about engineering and I liked it. I want to be an engineer when I get older. I was building the car tower to see, like, for construction. To, like, you're supposed to uh, develop a process in your head, and then you build a car structure, and, if you, and they place a the top a stuffed animal on it. And then if it don't fall, then it's good. And if it fall, it, it's not good. Um, the most fun thing that I did was make this box outside. Um, out of, and this is out of sheet metal. We use some machine to punch a hole into it. And then at the end, we use some type of pliers and put a nail into it. There's projects coming, whether they're new stadiums, there's a new bridge. Um, rebuilding I-94, I-75, infrastructure issues all over the state of Michigan. I mean, there's lots here in Southeast Michigan, but it's across the board, across the state, across the Midwest, and across the country. This is an opportunity for a job for a lifetime. The event was organized by MDOT, the Black Caucus Foundation of Michigan, Detroit Public Schools, and Michigan's Design and Construction Coalition, which is made up of associations and unions representing the industries. Today was a great day. 